one. So just kind of worth the talk for a few minutes. Um, it's something that I had on my mind. And again, people are like, oh, no, if he's at it again. Um, but yeah, I just kind of always worth the talk. And I'm kind of one of them people to just talk about it. Um, so yeah, just kind of worth the talk. Because again, it's an interesting thing to talk about. And it's something that, you know, many people do. Um, I suppose in the head think about. And, you know, it's something that the human mind thinks about a lot too. Even though we don't want to think about it or that. And that is where people laugh and those people talking behind their backs or whatever. Etc, etc, etc. Or what you're taking your head of. Because your mind is you know, your greatest weapon. And your mind is your greatest destroyer. Because it can make you and it can lose you. You can lose yourself in your mind. Um, if you let your mind run away with itself. Um, and obviously that's... you know, If you worry yourself and you you, know, you take over taking everything, that can affect you. It can affect your mental health, it can affect your physical health. Etc, etc, etc. And I had a post on what that said, you know, I don't care what people take. Um, and, you know, and then you turn around a few few weeks later and, you know, this person, like, you know, I, I do care what people take. And, you know, people often say that. But, you know, I say to people, I do care to a certain extent on what people take. This is me personally. Um, and I would be hurt if somebody said something very nasty. And one of them people, they get hurt very quickly and might just tell you straight. Um, which is not a good trait in a politician, I must be honest with you. Um, but again, th- that's just putting it straight. I'm putting I'm putting it straight as straight can be. Um, I'm not going to hide it. I'm not going to hide it in t- at all at all. Um, Danny Healy way. Um, but yeah, this person, you know, said... And again, I see this oftentimes. You know, people say, you know, I'm not worried about what people take away into that. Um, and, you know, they turn around when something's said about them and they say, you know, I do care. Um, and it was about us and whatever. Um... And that's, you know, that, that's normal. And again, I'm not criticising anybody for that because we all say it now and again. We all do say it, I don't care. Say if Johnny down the road takes... Um, <laughs> like, there's something from school I could say. Um, yeah, but I'm not going to say it. It's a good, it's a good laugh. But it's a really good laugh. Um, it's a good, it's a, it was a funny instant in the class. What's I'm not, not going to say it, but I say, maybe say it sometime, but not now. Um, it's really, really funny. <laughs> I was just laughing for the next hour or two. Um, but where was I? Say Johnny down the street says something about Mary, Timmy and Mary, that's going out for the last three weeks. Um, now, Timmy might not give a feck. Um, a typical man from County Cabin doesn't give a feck what anybody thinks of him. Um, he just cares about the money. Um, but Mary, on the other hand, you know, she's like, you know, to, to everybody when they're saying, oh, Timmy down the road said this about you. Um, Mary's just like, I don't care what he thinks. And then inside she do she just does care. And you know, you're often taking your mind too. Are they laughing at me? What are they gonna take about me? And this is what's going through in your mind. You might know you might not want to take like that, but your mind does go like that. Um like you know, I, I just kinda love you. I just kinda do, I just kinda don't think about the way anymore. Um if they laugh, they laugh, and you know, obviously you no know, there was often one time I take somebody said to me that somebody was laughing at me with these videos and again I would say to that person um, as I said at the time, I said to their response of they got talking to the person again. I said, you know, if they could go and do what I have to do, um, and again, I don't want to put myself on the pedestal, but again, this is the thing I said to them. If they can do what I can do, you know, and talk about issues that are affecting people, you will try and do something about it, contact TDs, and you will spend a huge amount of time emailing and emailing different departments and things like that, trying to get something achieved, trying to get something moved a bit, um, to try and achieve something, um, then, you know, come back to me. And, you know, prove me wrong. Because, you know, it's easy enough you know, for somebody to say something. Um, but again, you don't understand. Again, they under, you know, again, they're entitled to their opinion. But at the end of the day, laughing at somebody for, you know, the way they talk went to that, you know, again. I'd love to see if they were in the position that you were in. You know, again, you have to put yourself into their shoes. Um, and you have to take it. Because, again, there's a lot of things that gets me, for example. Just for example, I have dyslexia, a bit of autism. Um... And obviously my speech is a bit fucked. <laughs> that's me honest, you know, that's, forgive me for my language. Um, but you know, that's a good bit of gets you. You know, spelling and writing. Like for example, here I'd write up something there. And you know, there could be 60 or 70 spelling mistakes there. Um, and you know, that, that you know, again, it takes courage. It does take, it takes balls and it takes courage to come out and say it, well, say it straight and not hide it. Because again, that's not the type of person I am, I'll just say it straight. I'm not going <laughs> to hide around anything. Um, but yeah, you know, people do worry about that. That's something that goes through a lot of people's minds. You know, you do worry about it, even the strongest people, even the people that are the biggest cool kids in the country. Um, they often think about it. They often think about it. They, um, and they, and if they say they don't, they, they do. Because everybody thinks about it at one stage or another. 
and um, if somebody's laughing at me, if somebody's saying something behind my back, etc. etc. Again, oftentimes I hear people saying this. I don't care what people think, but inside people do care. They do care. Um and obviously it's somebody saying something extremely bad, you know, things like that. But again, in a relationship standpoint and things like that and when <laughs> see see I um but yeah you know we often hear sometimes some girls be saying you know some boys whatever the case I heard this once before um just using an example because it came into my head and I was just like you might as well say it um this this is the one time a boy said to a girl I don't care what you take I don't care if you take I'm fancy or anything like that um and obviously I'm like oh no what says all that um but yeah you know that girl was hurt by it and everything um by that. Um, and again, you have to think about, again, this person might be half, and again, she, I think this person said at the time that she was chatting to her for his friends and laughing and everything about this, etc, etc. That's obviously to totally wrong. Um, it's enough like saying to the person, you know, somebody rejecting you, like again, um, as a good friend of me, whole man got it rejected by Joe Biden, um, and he was left in his ass. <laughs> Um, but that was funny now, that was funny now. I think we can all agree, um, Joe Biden did very well there. Um, but yeah, you know, it does hurt when you're rejected in a relationship or uh, expressing your feelings to another man, a man or woman or whatever, etc, etc, etc. Um, it does hurt rejection. Um, it's something that's, you know, it's hard to deal with. It's a bit of pill to swallow, as they often say. But yeah, I just say to you, to rise above the laughter, um, to rise above it. Um, I know it's hard to do. It's not. It's very. It's not hard to do. It's it's hard to do. Excuse me, um. But you know, at the end of the day, as long as you're healthy and happy, and you know, to how to cut and what some people do take, you know, there's some people out there that just want to bring people down and annoy people and upset people, um. They're not good people to be around. Don't give a toss about what they say and what they think about you, and as long as your friends and your family and your neighbours and and your community, I'll I'll as a whole, I suppose, a small community as a whole thing you, you where you live. As long as they have a decent enough opinion on you and everything like that, that's all that matters. At the end of the day, forget what Timmy and Johnny takes. Um, as long as you know that you're doing the right thing and you're having a bit of a laugh now and again, um, to how and to connect on what they take and if they laugh at you or whatever. Um, because at the end of the day, if you know you're doing something right, then, because you know, again, this will always happen to everybody, but don't pass any remarks on. That's as simple as don't pass. Like, I used to worry, and again, I hate to be talking all the time about everything like this, but again, it's always stretching a bit long. I didn't mean that way, but I'm sorry, stretching a long distance the video. I meant to say, sorry, I completely just said the complete wrong opposite thing. Sorry, the video stretching a bit long. I hate to have long videos and people listening to me for 24 hours. Um. But yeah, it ha it's often happened, and it happened to me when I was younger, you know, I often cared about what people think. You're over-cared, I suppose. It's good to care, don't get me wrong. But over-caring and, and trying to please everyone, um, it's something that you, you, know, you can't achieve. It's like a master magician to achieve that. Um, you know, again, you can't, you can't please everybody. You really can't please everybody. So yeah. And I used to worry time and time again about people laughing and people laughing behind my back, sniggering and laughing and things like that. Um, don't, 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 don't. Um, because that just drives you mad. And that's just going to drive you mad, uh, mad in your mind, thinking about that all the time. Um, so just forget about it. Do something you like. You walk over, walk over one. Play your video games. Take your mind off it. Don't worry about it. Um, again, as I always say, as long as your friends and your family are with you, then that's all that matters. The hell and the cunt. With everything else, um, I know what's said from the eighteen hundreds, but anyway, thank you for watching. Take care, everybody, and I hope that helped out somebody a bit. Um, so yeah, take care.